Hello and welcome. In this lesson, we will focus on understanding the contents of the ANSYS issued license file. It is important for the users to know some basic information printed in the license file licenses, which opens the door for understanding the available assets, their corresponding increments and more importantly, the product selection for download and installation. Let's get started. ANSYS uses flex-based license keys, which are specially formatted and encrypted text files containing information about the machine on which the license daemons will run, the vendor daemon name, and a list of increments for each feature in the toolset which specifies the available number of licenses, expiration date, and issued start date. The easiest way to identify the ANSYS issued license file is by looking at the file name. They start with license ANSYS hybrid text name and newer licenses start with ANSYS license. You should be able to open the license file in Notepad. The first line denotes the server host name and host ID for which it was created. The second line denotes the vendor daemon name. ANSYS licenses are issued under ANSYS LMD. There is a list that shows all the products that are licensed in the file with number of seats and its respective lease or technical enhancement and customer support expiry date based on the type of license. Upon further moving down, you will find the list of increments that license each file feature in the toolset. Note, the license files are encrypted using the system host ID information. Making changes to the content results in a tampered license file. The increments in the license files are not listed in any specific order. The product to feature mapping is available as PDF and CSV document in the customer portal, downloads, installation and licensing help and tutorials under the licensing tab. This document contains the increment names packaged under each product along with increment descriptions. For example, let's search for the keyword mechanical enterprise. It lists all the increments that come with the mechanical enterprise package. Now, if you would like to specifically know what DSDXM is, table 4 will give you the description. All the ANSYS installers can be found in the customer portal under the downloads and by clicking the current release tab. First, you will need to choose the operating system on which you would like to install the software. Packages are available as ISO image files or individual packages. The ISO image file contains all the structures, fluids, prep post and optics packages in the three image files. If you would like to specifically download select packages, you can choose the primary packages in the download type dropdown. There is a small question mark button next to each package that details the capabilities and tools in that particular installer. Similarly, there is a separate tab where you can download the Ensite product, VRX, Semiconductor and Model Center products respectively. That brings us to the end of the lesson.